Hello everyone, it's me, David Klopic, and finally I get to do another episode of the David Klopic show. So you know what? Let's do something different again. Today we're gonna be showing you some cancer I have over here. This is supposed to be show with, but it's not showcasing. I mean, oh, you really have to do that. Today we're gonna be reading some cancer made by me, David Klopic the Younger. Because I, when I used to be small, I used to do all weird shit. I used to write dictionaries, I used to write books, and I used to write, well, random shit. And so in today's episode, we're gonna be checking some of this cancer out. So, without further ado, let's -a go! Alright, so here we are. We have some, we have quite a lot of cancer in this. And I'm gonna start with the biggest one, of course. Ladies and gentlemen, in this textbook, something great is hidden. This notebook contained all the secrets for my Sakura Gaoka novel. Ladies and gentlemen, may I present to you the prototype edition of Sakura Gaoka, made by me. And just by looking at the actual cover, you can clearly see that it needs some work out. I'm still not the best in drawing, but I'm doing my best. Alright, since I don't want you guys to go through all this cancer, but I will make, make it 10 minutes long for that stupid ad revenue. I'm just kidding, I don't even monetize my videos. Alright, I'm gonna be reading you the introduction. And I'm only gonna read the introduction. Or maybe I could read the, the first chapter as well. That won't be too bad, won't it? Let's uh, go and read this piece of shit. <clears throat> Introduction. About me. Hello there, random guy who got this book. You must have got it because you're interested or something. Allow me to demonstrate to you the current situation I'm in. My name is Miku Toriyama, by the way. I was born somewhere near Berlin. Yes, you're wondering how did that happen. Of course I'm not fucking wondering. My parents changed my name when I was 10 years old. Before that, I was named Sebastian. Well, actually, that, that, is, that is the only thing that left. I, he was actually named Sebastian, but then he was changed to Miku Toriyama, so he can enroll, enroll into a school in Japan. I live in a wealthy family, so we don't have any problems. However, I'm very different from the rest of the boys. I actually don't talk with them. My dad taught me some secrets that can help me decide which girl I really like. Now that sentence does not make any sense. First of all, it's not formulated well, and then again, this is me when I was younger. No, 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 hold on, hold on. I actually wrote this in middle school, and yet I'm still going in middle school. How the fuck did I grow out of it so fucking quickly? That's right, you read it. I'm all about girls. I like girls because A, they're very nice, B, they're beautiful, and C, some of them are quite hot. They are, all, they are also rare creatures that can comfort you in almost every situation. These rare creatures, it's so cringy. I can't stand it already. Ah, oh, okay. Alright, I'll read a little bit more and then we're gonna go to the chapter one. Okay. When you need help for homework, they help. When you're sad, they help. When you're in trouble, they help. Is there at least one thing that the girls can't do? Well, there's one thing, but for the sake of the female audience, I won't say it. Okay, I, I'm, I'm just gonna go to the first chapter already. Chapter 1. Mission Impossible. Chapter 1. Okay. There was a march. A General York march. I was still sleepy and haven't realized I was going in a plane. I had to wash my face so I can see what was going down there. I was con confused, so I asked my dad. And now as you can see, this is also what I did, and there's still in the, in the new novel, I use roles in a story. It's a drama and a novel at the same time. And that's a good step up for me. Maybe the next book won't have these dialogues, they will just have like, uh, quotation marks and then someone says something, quotation marks closed, said he, she or it. Fucking, I don't know. Alright. Dad, what is this? Well, son, how don't you realize that you have a mission in Japan? Alright, I'm very sorry, I'm trying to imitate the German accent, but... 
Then again, I will look so racist. Uh, what mission? You accepted the mission, right? What mission? The Great Sakura Gog. Oh, fuck off. Fucking hell. This is so cancerous. Okay, you know what? Fuck it, it's already six minutes. I'm not wasting my time. In other words, the rest of the stuff is just too fucking cancerous. I don't want you to suffer through this too much. Next up, we have this. In this notebook is my first... No, wait, it's not my first. My second manga ever created. It doesn't look very nice because it's in a notebook, but luckily it has no lines, so it's perfect for that occasion. Allow me to introduce you to the technology of misunderstanding, or as I like to call it. My name is Jeff. Alright, so basically, this is based on one of my dreams and of, as well as one of the series I created that I don't have right now with me. It's called, well, it's called Fighting Dreamers Incorporated. And this is the, and if you see this, my drawing is there and didn't look that bad actually, except Except Simon, you look at that fucking smile. That smile is gonna fucking kill you in the night. If you like this video, then this face won't be your nightmare. If you don't, then good luck trying to fight it. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, there, this isn't that much of a cancer, but considering I did this in elementary, in middle school again, in the first grade, supposedly that's cancer as well. But let's go and read it. You know what's the cancer in this? The fucking drawings. Don't even, they don't even look nice. They don't even look nice. Alright, so I'll show you something. Hold on. Uh, so there's this flying sequence says, Oh no. Oh wait. I got way too excited that I forgot to stop. That's kind of funny. I have to be honest. Then again, freaking Vienna is up in this as well. Ah, I haven't, I have done so many Vienna references and shit. Oh, how much I appreciate it. Okay, hold on. So basically this is more like, there's Nodoka, Nodoka Manabe, the, the most forgotten character in the k series, and the one that gets a spotlight in my novel for some reason. But looking at Nodoka, she actually looks adorable, don't you think? And that'll call you a little down. So this isn't too much of a cancer. My draw drawings can still be better. Because it's quite bullshit, if you ask me. And then again, we have something... Fucking this. Fucking... I can't really say this is cancer. I can just say... I can just say... It's no longer... She's no longer with us. I'm just kidding. She hasn't died. Don't worry. She hasn't died. I'm just not friends with her anymore. We used to do this all the fucking day. Like when we went to Budapest, Bratislava and Vienna, we used to take pictures together. How fucking... Oh, will you look at that? Will you look at that? There's a secret photo. That, that's, that's her signature. Joka Nikolic. Yep. Yep. Yes, I said it now. I told you I'm never gonna mention her. Apparently, I did. Fuck. Alright, um, well the pictures aren't that important as well, because we're done with our friendship, let's just move on to our next cancer. Oh boy, not this cancer, this is cancer. Alright, welcome to the worst manga ever. <sighs> this is anime elimination. I, I watched uh, the battle for Dream Island and I kind of got insp inspired to make the exact same thing but with anime characters. Unfortunately, I came to the half and I just gave up. Like, what the fuck? And there's the speaker thing. You remember the speaker thing? Fucking great, isn't it? Anyways, we have characters, uh, naturally 50 participants and special ones. Fucking, uh, great. Okay, your host? Or this, this speaker thing. <laughs> Alright. Alright, so there are some characters. Um, yeah, um, you don't have to see. So I can just take, uh, you have Goku, Vegeta, Naruto, is it Uzumaki or Umu? I think I wrote Uzumaki because I saw that somewhere. So I'm gonna assume it's Uzumaki. I don't fucking care. It's not like I watched that anime anyways. I'm all about them high school vibes. Like, fucking K-On! But the movie wasn't really <clears throat> my kind of jam. <laughs> okay. And then you have uh, Seki Toshinari. That guy that annoys you with stupid toys. 
And then again, if you take a look at the drawings, you'll see what I mean. Pretty, pretty fucking... Look at this, hold on. Well, that's, that's, that's definitely a good sign, isn't it? And there's Akihisa with his giant ass mouth. I'm not gonna bother with this again. I mean, I can show you a little bit of the battle, though. It's not fair that I just... Oh, shit. Example, this scene. Fucking... Uh, wait, where is it? Aha. Uh -huh. There's Rika. Rika. She takes out her devil eye, comes close to this guy. Who's this? Oh, it's Bell. Bell Cranel from... From Danmachi. Fucking... Fucking... Karf. I don't know if that's a word. I just said it out of nowhere. Next up... This is my first book where I draw characters. Ladies and gentlemen, prepare to get your eyes blown. I did this when I was in elementary school, and my style still didn't involve into the chibi characters, but rather realistic style characters. They don't even look that realistic. Like, my head is now like an oval, like an ellipse upside down. Rotated 90 degrees. And uh, if you take a look at this, that's me. That's fucking me. Yes, I know what you're thinking. What the fuck is that monster? That monstrosity is me. David Klopic. This is on Serbian. So, yeah, that's pretty much stuff to... It was such good times. And this is something Philip made for me. Here's a little... That's Private Ryan. It's PVT Ryan, of course. Fucking parodies. That's because I don't have any inspiration whatsoever. Bullshit and quite shit. Next up, we have another manga. This time, it's a bit of violent one. But again, I never finished it, nor I never, nor I ever will. Fucking uh, four eyes. Fucking four eyes. So there is, there are the news. Monsters are getting involved. Blah blah blah. Shit gets serious, and then. Oh my god, 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 there we go. That sick, that, wait, it says, that sick son of a bitch. Yeah, and I used to censor words. <laughs> if I ever create Del Sex Machina, well, I, I better, I better not censor the words because it'll make it a lot of fun. Then again, I have to learn how to draw pussy, not, not the one, not the cats, I mean, them pussy, you know. Alright, enough about dirty talk, let's talk a bit clean. Here we have my first ever manga to be created in a chibi style. Ladies and gentlemen, may I present to you... Pa -pa 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 -pa! Nichijou Powered Up. And by the title, yes, Nichijou has inspired me to create this little series. And they're rather great, but there's shit. There's a shit ton of mistakes in here. This is like uh, weird. It's a weird chibi style. So let us go and read the explosion that made the planet wonder. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Hold on. Uh, all right. Sorry about that. All right. So there's the fake kingdom. You remember that ship? They basically, there's Princess Starla who used to throw her minions away for no actual reason. She just hits the switch and fucking they're done. Probably when they hit the ground, they collapse into several pieces. And then this is the perfect chance to say, rest in pieces. All right, so then again, we have this. All right, let me read this for you a little. This should be perfect. Uh, there's the minion, there's minion number 31, having a mega changer, and it says, the princess will so understand, says minion 24, when I could, minion 47, and it actually became a proper hitman, I'm just kidding, there's no such thing as minion 47, but the grammar here is just so fucking bullshit, even I, the creator of this, cannot stand it, then again we have, uh, and a miniature style. I used to do this until I went to like middle school and did the other one. And then I just did like this, 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 and then there are only two. And here we have 202. And uh, look at this. F 
fucking fucking quality content all right then again we have so much good stuff here this actually brings back such good memories i used to bring this with me when i went to budapest fuck all right let me show you something there used to be a teacher called Admir Keshetovich. I don't know if he's still going into that I think he's still going. I saw him one day. And um, he's actually a really nice guy, considering that he, whenever he's in elementary school, as a teacher, everyone gets good grades. And even if you cheat, that's fine. He doesn't catch you. Not like that fucking chemistry teacher in my middle school. You write it on the fucking wall, and then the teacher just notices you if you're doing a uh, 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 He just comes closer Quietly and then just boom looks at it and says who made this masterpiece? Who made this masterpiece of a cheat code or whatever? Yeah, I did that and I got an F for fuck's sake Well, I guess that teaches me one lesson never cheat on his tests <laughs> Let's conclude for one thing. Then we have something cute. This is cute, not a cancer. Like, oh, I'm sorry. This is not cancer, but this. This isn't that cancer as well, but still very forgotten, I might say. I forgot it somehow. It's Super Test Rhythmic Session. Something like Rhythm Heaven Fever by Super Test Style. Where everything starts all in one place. I think the better, better, better motto would be the rhythm is just a hit away. We got mini games. We have all the mini games. We have ease access. No, nah, wait. Uh, warm up. The runaway. So these are the mini games. So let me read them for you. Fan clap club. Date park. Remix one. Which is the humble start. Clappy bird. Yes, I said Clappy Bird. Windows Props. Breakhouse. Working. And Remix 2. Working till retired. Brushy Teeth. Uno Momento. Got to go fast. Bouncy Ball. Remix 3. Motorism. Drinking Cub. Featuring. Oh, wait, featuring. Oh, wait. It's Tobita, the, the only boy in the audience. I used to fucking do this. There's the first deviation I ever uploaded involving a girl, a cheerleading girl. I don't know if I still have it. I think I have, but it's now just so cancerous. Anyways, then we have Rectation Mate, Remix 4, Rock and Roll, Rock and Roll, get it? Rock and Roll. <laughs> fucking Rock and Roll puns. I don't like puns that much, actually. I mean, they're pissing me off. Rhythmscape, Love Labs, Trapana Stamina, Trapana tra, 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 Stamina, what? Alright, this is cancelled now. You can do it. Okay, you know what? Medium stadium. Okay. This is not. This is my book for Japanese. My writing was terrible back then. Dang it. But then again, I have this fucking Itadakimasu, a course by me. There's a first, I think this is like the first, oh wait, this is, this is invisible shit. Give me a sec, I'll search for it. Aha, uh -huh, there it is. Alright, there it is. And there you go. This is David Klopi, CH CH at the end. That's probably like the first time I've ever written my name like that. Again, have no fucking clue why, but it looks good. It looks good. This looks nice. And yeah, I have to take a break now. Then again, more cancerous drawings. But, I do appreciate what I did here. I actually used to make this on Japanese, which is rather good. Alright, here we go. Konnichiwa. Ah, no. Doshitano e i i e. Ah, genki desu ka? Genki desu. Anata wa genki desu. Hai, arigato gozaimasu. It, okay, okay. 
行ってきます。行ってらっしゃい。さようなら。Alright, so yeah, this is、um, too bad it's unfinished. I'd really love to do this. Then again, there's this, another comic. They actually look so damn good, actually. Too bad I didn't, I didn't do anything much of it. I have to, now I have to make a Rain Hast version, except it won't be called Itadakimasu. It's probably gonna be called Slovene 101. And then again, if I ever travel to Slovenia, I just take it down and say, Dobar dan, um, želite prosim, uh, eno kavo prosim, izvolite, hvala, na ljepša hvala, na svidenje, i to i to. Fucking, fucking Slovene and its wonders. This is not cancer, by the way. The drawings are, but the concept isn't. There's the second one. I uh, know, a perfect game. Or maybe just a few of them. Alright, there's just, there's just cancer in here. Look at this. Fucking, <laughs> fucking me. <laughs> fucking memes. <laughs> Fucking memes into this. All right, now we're talking. Then again, nothing else is in here. There's a full picture. So happy that will make you. Hey. Oh, well, look at that. Fucking zato zato. I shouldn't be saying this. Swear words every fucking where. Then again, here's my first Chibi style drawings that I actually made. On some proper paper. This is on Serbian yet again. Hope you're enjoying it. Enjoying it so far. That's Nicola. He's supposed to be fat and chubby, but who knows? Hold on, what's this? Dunya with a note. It actually looks cute though, but it's still cancer nonetheless. Oh, that was supposed to be it, but fortunately, I still have one thing to show you. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the biggest cancer in the lifetime. No such thing is this cancerous. Even more cancerous than the video I reacted to a few days before. Ladies and gentlemen, All right, oh fuck, fuck, for fuck's sake. This is, ladies and gentlemen, my very first book. Book. Super test. History of super test. Fucking great. I'm gonna be reading you a certain movie, movie description. No, no, no. Alright, I'll be reading you one of uh, imaginary characters, so uh, enjoy yourself. Alright. Tsumugi Kotobuki. You really can't miss her. She's important. Whenever Super Test is sad, she's the one to comfort him. She's like his brother, but it's way beyond that point. How cute. She first appeared in K-On, she appeared in Super Test Fighting Dreamers Incorporated, her specialty is the keyboard and the piano. And blah 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 blah. My fucking hell. Look at the drawing though. It's, it's kind of bullshit considering they actually wore this kind of outfit. And then again, there's Mio who looks like a fucking. I'm not gonna be racist. There's Nodoka. There's Nodoka Manabe. I actually drew. I actually drew her as well. Her glasses are holding her hand because I had no idea how to draw them. Fucking hell. Then again, she looks cute. Uh, Pinio, Miku Azune, Tien Masta, Saeka Takazaki. She used to appear in the Book of David Lopez, but then again. Bullshit! Alright, so I'm gonna be doing. I'm gonna be showing you one of these stuff, but I'm gonna upload it to DeviantArt, so go ahead and give it a visit. And with that out of the way, that is pretty much it. 
I ran out of cancer, I'll probably find more in the future, but I just wanted to share this with you guys to see how, how much of a cancer were my drawings and texts that I did in the first grade of middle school and the ninth grade of elementary school. So, this has been the David Floppy Show, so have a nice day and see you all next time. Fucking double revenue. But I'm not monetizing, I'm just saying. Yeah,